So Franklin right now is scraping up some of the uh, detritus of this uh, van's past former life in Japan. Uh, we don't know what this is, some kind of uh, soft carpet thing that has melted into the floor. Uh, along with the, uh, the uh, mat has also melted. But uh, what happens? How's it going there, Franklin? Van life, man. Van life. Hashtag, hashtag fan life. Yep. We're here at the marina, here at West Haven Marina in Kiwi Land. We've got our future floor sitting right there. Uh, so we're just gonna cut that to shape. Luckily the, the mat is still usable enough that we have the perfect shape uh, of the floor of the van. So we'll just uh, use a, uh, a jigsaw to cut the, these round bits here. And then we're just going to use the, uh, the bolts that are already in the van to bolt those down. The bolt, bolt holes. The, the bolt holes, yeah, we're going to bolt the floor down like that. And then we got uh, 12, 12 millimeter thick ply, so that'll be uh, thick enough that we can just uh, we can just screw uh, the furniture into that, and that'll be secure. Um, and yeah, that's it for the floor. You know, pretty darn simple. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. All right. Here we are, day two. We've uh, successfully cut out the. Uh, particle board that was going to be our floor. Plywood. Plywood. It's underneath this beautiful tarp. As you can see, the lovely winter Auckland weather has stopped us for a little bit. Franklin's quite sad. He wants to keep going. But we're going to test out some of these drill bits that our buddy Phil has lent us. I'm going to try and make it so that uh, this is flush inside the wood when we bolt our floor down. Um, yeah, lovely rain. We've got the floor in, looking beautiful. It was so oh fun my. cutting that floor with the jigsaw. Franklin has uh, securely bolted the floor down at three different points. And there are two other points that uh, we did not drill correctly, but it's really no bother. They're inconsequential. Inconsequential. So Franklin has uh, managed to get a bolt stuck in one of them, so we're just trying to get that out. Um, it's raining, but we are securely in the van. The first van shelter. So this is uh, day four, I think. Yeah. And we've decided to... Uh, Cool heartily or not, put uh, cork tiles on the wall to match as both insulation and possibly cool looking siding. Um, it's going kind of slowly, but I think sped up as we're getting the technique down, just using this uh, industrial strength adhesive. Uh, Yay, chemicals! Lots of chemicals. And uh, Donna is anticipating shaping on the siding to fit every fit little nook and cranny of the van. So uh, we'll see how it goes. But uh, yeah, now just getting high on uh, <laughs> industrial strength adhesive. Yeah, so. Mm -hmm. Hi. So what have we completed? Um, well, nothing yet. <laughs> Still corking. Day three of corking. Day three of corking. What are you doing now? <clears throat> what stage are we at in the van? We're at a very uh, ex uh, important stage, my friend. We are uh, sanding, corking. Basically, cork the entire walls. Now we're sanding all the corners down and we're going to fill in all these little cracks with the putty and again and be done
So Donna, what just happened? We got the bed in. We got the bed in. We got the bed in. Nice. What did we do? How many support posts did we put in? We put 16 support posts. Holy moly. 23 look. centimeters high. That was a very uh, specific number that we chose so that we could sit up all the way. So there's going to be a 10, 10 centimeter thick mattress here. So. Look at all this headspace I have. Look at all that headspace. And uh, yeah. there's going to be a cabinet here, very fancy cabinet for our clothing. We're calculating where these cabinets will go and how how far up, how far back, the angle, 45 degrees, see geometry, everything like that here. <laughs> that is has to record it just to show that it's real and it actually happened. Backsplash thing in, our little back wall, and uh, it's a beautiful day here in the marina. Give thanks. Give thanks, Donna. Thanks, Frank. Ch choke up. Back straight. We're gonna choke up and back straight. Wow. Hi, Mr. Macy's. Hi, Mr. Macy's. Look at me. Look at me. I'm Donna Macy's. So we have a. A beautiful uh, countertop now. Look at this. Look at this. Countertop. Look at that. Look at those angles. Oh. Oh. So the end of day 10 has come. Or 11? Oh, who knows? Who knows? 8,000. But uh, Van is looking really fucking good. So we've really got. Fucking good. We've got our cabinet in. Opens up. I've got to still install some way to open that nicely. But that's a great cabinet. You know, still some minor whatever. Uh, there's a Franklin. Looking at the sunset. Uh, we've got the skeleton of our kitchen cabinets, and we've got our countertop, future sink, it's a giant sink, uh, beautiful backsplash, mate, empty glass of wine, life is good. Life is great. Life is great. Praise, praise the mother, the goddess. And jaw. Hey Donna, what are we doing? Hey, we just bought our new mattress. Where are we? Like, oh, we're in the mall. It's a great place to buy a mattress. Yeah, we're in a people mover. Woo! I'm doing the happy dance. Happy dance. It's after the third try. We finally got our self containment certification. This means that you can basically camp in New Zealand wherever you want and you can uh, yeah, just park the van in any place. Um, I did learn all sorts of plumbing and strapping toilets down and everything like that from a very disgruntled Englishman. But uh, I'm done, we got it, and uh, now we can hit the road. What's going on?
What are we doing? Hey, so we're setting off today. This is the big day. Big day? It's our maiden voyage. Boop -a -dup -a -dup -dup! There's uh, the van, which is a bit of a shit show right now. We'll give you a, a lovely viewing once it is in perfect condition. So here's pilot. Yeah, here we go. Pilot Franklin. Strap in, everyone. Secure your seat belts. Remember your sense of adventure. All right, Dunklin out. Safety third. <laughs> da, 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 da. We're officially hashtag man life. Oh. And we are now doing the pain and suffering we've put in for this. <laughs> Is it worth it? Oh, now it's raining, so let's go inside. 